This is uh, the C4 connector for a 2009 and 2012 uh, Dodge Ram. This is the connector where it is going to be on your vehicle that you want to connect, get to under the tip to get to this wire. Or if you have an empty slot, which is slot three, um, this is for the hood jar. If you already have this wire, a purple blue wire, or whichever color you have, it's always going to be purple blue wire, but um, you want to remove this one and add our new one. So we're going to show you how to do that. So um, let's get started. So first, uh, behind the connector, as you can see, there is these gaps. This will help you to remove uh, this so we can get to the terminal uh, locking clip. So if you want to just get a pick and pull it up like this, like so, and uh, just push it out however you can. Then it's out, put it aside. So now, as you can see inside, there is the locking tab underneath the terminals. So you wanna just push that down and pull the wire out and that's how it, it will release it. So let me show you how to do that. So mine, this is the third one. So it would be one, two, three, right there. So we're gonna push it down and pull the wire. You saw how I pushed it down. Let's do it again and put it back up so you can see it. So push it down and pull the wire. Okay. And then, then we can pull out the wire. Notice that this tab is the bottom side. That's actually where it locks right here. So that's how the new one's gonna go in. So this is the new harness uh, that you will be getting from us, AutoTech. Um, it's a black wire like this. This, of course, we're gonna show you the instructions and how they get to the, for the new hood jar switch on your truck, but uh, let's go ahead and do this part for the connector. So first on your connector, to be able to get the wire smoothly in, you actually wanna remove this black tab. So as you can see, I just went in here, scooped it out. Let's do this side, went in here, scooped it out. Then we're just gonna move it a little bit, not too much. And remember, one, two, three. So slot three. And so like I said, um, the tabs are gonna go in this way. So we're gonna go in through here like this. And then before I go in, let me show you. So there is gonna be this cover, as you can see. You're gonna wanna go into the third hole. So, we're going in, take a little bit of force, then we're in. So then you wanna go in through here and you could be able to see the terminal coming up and there it locked in. So do not close this until we're done. So we're gonna actually get this one in first so we don't have to move anything around. If anything moves, just place it back Make it straight. If it turns around, turn it around. So once you have it all straight or somewhat straight or in this slot, you wanna go ahead and just position this and lock it in. Then come through the back and lock these in. Make sure everything's there. Everything's fine, nothing's moved. And there, you're done. 